We're cruising the East Coast and Bahamas too. On the Hangover Three, we're living a dream come true. Schooly bus adventure across the USA with friends, cocktails each and every day. We're what the hell adventures, and that's our name. Living life full of playing life's game. We're always on the go, and we're seeking brand new thrills, making memories together. And that's what gives us all our thrills. doing here this you know how we like to do kind of crazy stuff and stuff that's outside the box who so, us yeah I'm <laughs> thinking since we're building tiny houses now and we don't want anything to be just generic we were talking about well we can do wood on the ceiling but everybody's done it then we got to thinking why not put steel up there trim it out in some sort of wood I don't know what color yet right, right now it's everything's an experiment but we went and got some scrap messed up steel and uh, and we're playing with it and we're leaving it out right now because it's supposed to rain all day today all day tomorrow when it starts we're gonna let it out let it rust let it see what happens to it and then if it looks good we're gonna put it on the ceiling of the tiny house and uh, I think it'll be cool I hope it will I mean We've done metal backsplashes, and they turned out really, really nice, but they were too rusty because you use vinegar, and you use that, and, you, and then it doesn't look natural. I'm trying, hoping this will just be natural, and most of it is. We, you know, we, It looks good. I think it's going to be cool. I think when we put it up there, cut out random patterns and just mismatch pieces. I think it'll look good. I think so too. Yeah. So. So we'll come back after it rains and see what it looks like. Yeah. Come along with us. Hopefully it'll look good. If it don't, then we ain't lost anything. Some scrap metal. <laughs> That's it. I need an inch and a half pipe. What? <laughs> you checking out my awesome plumbing? Yeah. Putting in a toilet. And we got this vent pipe put in. Yep. And now we got to do awesome. what? Uh, I got to stub out for the sink, stub out for the vanity. Without washer and dryer. And I got to stub out, yep, for the washer and dryer. So, um, yeah, that's what I got to do. So we got all our electrical wires put in. Yep, starting to look like a tiny house. Yep, then we gotta 
Got the roof going on tomorrow? Hopefully. Don't rain. And then the insulation going in on Monday? Hopefully. Then we, <laughs> then we can start doing our thing. Then we can start making progress. Then we can start seeing things happen. So This is going to be the trim that goes around the doors and the windows on the outside. It's going to look good with that black metal. Yeah, it's gonna, that's really going to pop. And then we got to figure out what door color we want. I'm thinking neon green. Mm-hmm. She's not. Yeah, we got some choices over here. We're going to get some more opinions, of course. But I can tell you which one it's not going to be. Either one of those. Never say never. Never say never. All right, get back to work. You get back to work. Hey, babe, where are you going? <clears throat> what do you mean? I'm going under here. My favorite thing in the world to do is plumbing. Sweet. I usually hit my head at least 12 times while I'm doing this. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see what we can do today. At least 12 times. So yesterday we got our roof on in the pouring down rain. Can't really see it, but it's on. And then next week, the siding will go on. But today, we're plumbing. And we're plumbing in the mud. Yep. I was just putting in the drain to my bathtub. This is the one thing I'm so excited about. Because on our boat, we don't have a bathtub. Mm-mm. But our tiny house will have a bathtub. Is that right? Yep. And we won't be here hardly none. That's okay. When we're here, guess what? <laughs> when it's cold, guess what? I can take a hot bath. Mm-hmm. In my jetted bathtub. I'm so freaking excited. Are you excited? Tickled to death. <laughs> Can't you tell? <laughs> I don't know how to contain myself. <laughs> no, nope, I am excited. I'm glad. Whatever, whatever makes you happy makes me happy, baby. That's so sweet. You're the sweetest man I know. Mm -hmm. I know. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see here. Let's see here. Do you know what you're doing? Nope. Zero clue. Hold that. Of course I know what I'm doing. He has no clue what he's doing. I have a lot of clues what I'm doing. I've done this you see that? He's already cut out a hole in the tiny house. Well, I can help us. A man got to do what a man got to do. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? What you got on your elbows? <laughs> Just shut up. I mean, it's hard crawling around like this under there. <laughs> I got old. I can't handle that crawling like I used to. Got knee pads on your elbows, knee pads on your knees. <laughs> I can't help it. I, I've gotten old. I can't do this crap. <laughs> Leave me alone. I got work to do. I ain't got time to be playing. All right, I got to go to work. It's a mighty long blade you got there. Thank you. You know what? I'm going to cheat a little bit. Are you going to start it with that? It looks like the struggle is real this morning. <laughs> <laughs> I hate being under a house. <laughs> it's, it's, it's rough when you get fat and old. <laughs> and I, mean, I missed the part where Russell was rolling around in the water line. 
Y'all didn't get to see that. But it was pretty hilarious. <laughs> Leave me alone, damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Oh God! Hey. Oh. 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 Sorry for autograph. Today is <laughs> running water line under the house. Hey, I got a, I got a better plan. What's your plan? You come here. Why is your plan involve me getting out? Uh, I'm gonna be the yoke grunting and groaning. <laughs> and here we go. Today we have insulation getting ready to go in. We got Nelligan insulation out of Lynchburg. Getting ready to go inside. They are taping everything up, getting it ready to spray, putting spray foam in the ceiling. It's going to be exciting. Well, we're airtight. Got the insulation done, got everything caulked in. Uh, props to Nelligan Insulation. Uh, they did a great job. And the guys that were here, so professional. I mean, they were just, they did an amazing job. Friendly, easy to talk to. I, that, I liked them. I, I'm very impressed with them. You don't find that that often these days. So, uh, now we can start uh start getting our trim stained and getting everything ready to to do the outside and then we're hopefully going to sheetrock the inside and get rolling i'd like to be living in it shortly after christmas so or have it sold shortly after christmas one or the <laughs> other whatever it's what we do yep looks good this is it so far She is sealed up, and it's crazy because it's so quiet in here now. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you don't hear anything. They did an amazing job. Very impressed with them. Yep, so we got to roll. I got work done. I ain't got time to be uh, starring in no movies or nothing. What are, you trying, what are we trying to determine now? I, I don't know. We're trying to figure out how to put... We want metal on the build, on the walls. Metal, right? So we've changed our mind. We're not yeah. putting metal on the ceilings now. We're putting metal on the walls and yeah. going to do sheetrock on the ceilings. Yeah. We just ran just our so speaker wire, so we'll have... Surround sound. Yep. But the problem you're going to have is when you put the metal up there, you don't want just random seams that don't look right. You want seams that... If they're random, they need to look like they were deliberately done random. And if they're, I don't know what I'm saying. I just don't, I, I don't want it to look cheesy. It's got to look good. I don't know how to make that happen. So, anyway. We'll come back to this. Yeah, because I have no clue what I'm doing right now. None. And there you go. Yep. <laughs> looking good babe thank you sweetheart um i think i need a nail here i think that's gonna look pretty cool don't I think, you i think so too i think it's gonna look really cool everything we do looks cool though baby give me a the drill there sweetie pie okay Looking good. Yep. If I'd have thought about it, so if you have to have another piece like it right there, if I'd have thought about it, I'd have flipped it, and then the two pieces would have matched. You can always take it down. No. <laughs> no, I can always leave it just like it is. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> where's my tape? Oh, yeah. uh, so those, that one's got to be at an angle. What do you mean? Yeah, it does. It ain't no big deal. I know it doesn't look as much now, but it's going to look freaking awesome when we're done. Oh, yeah. When we get everything trimmed out, it will be. So even the dude yesterday that looked at it said, man, that's, that's going to be just cool. Well, that's because we're cool. At least, uh, at least I am. Yeah. 
All right, let's see. Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's measure. So, 100, let's just say 119 to save ourselves a lot of work. 119 by 117. One nineteen down to one seventeen. Yep. We got two inch drop. So we need to be thirteen and a half. Or thirteen and we'll do another thirteen and three quarters for all I care. Let's do it. All right. Thirteen and three quarters. <clears throat> Hard to do all this with jacked up knees, all right. Oh, where am I? Good trophy, cute. This piece is so pretty. So why are you clearing it? So that it won't, because we're gonna have to be handling it. And I, this one brushes off too easy. In other words, the stuff comes off of it very, very, very easily. It smudges. And we're gonna put a coat of clear on all of it. All of it, yeah. To make it shiny. And just to make sure it doesn't rust anymore. Yeah, exactly. It's looking good, babe. It is. So far, so good. Uh, yep, so far, so good. Uh, I like the contrast in those two there. Yeah, it's pretty. Probably really hard to tell on video, but yeah, it's gonna look good. That's pretty awesome, isn't it? It is pretty awesome. <laughs>